Gather round ye lads and lasses, set ye for a while And hearken to me mournful tale about the Emerald Isle Let's all raise our glasses high to friends and family gone And lift our voices in another Irish drinking song Consumption took me mother and me father got the pox Me brother drank the whiskey till he wound up in a box me other brother in the troubles met with his demise Me sister has forever closed her smiling Irish eyes Now everybody's dying, so until our tears are dry We'll drink and drink and drink and drink and then we'll drink some more We'll dance and sing and fight until the early morning light Then we'll throw up, pass up, wake up and then go drinking once again Kenny was killed in Kilkenny in Clare, she died in Clare Tip from Tipperary died out in the dead year Shannon jumped into the river, Shannon back in June Ernie fell into the urn and Tom is in the tomb Now I've been a wild rover for many years the year I've spent all my money on whiskey and beer But now
Doesn't smell like Irish Spring and he never taught me anything. But still I swell my chest and sing of my drunken Irish dad. Oh, his face looks like a railroad map and he never shuts his freaking trap. But all the ladies catch the clap from your drunken Irish dad. Ask a Hennessy, Tennessee, Morris and Shaughnessy, Riven and Rooney, they'll tell you the same. McNulty, Mulrooney and Cotter and Cooney all feel the same mixture of pride and of shame. Finnegan, Hannigan, Kelly and Flanagan look to the ground when their dad passes by. Cafferty, Rafferty, Joyce and O'Lafferty fight for his honor and then start to cry. Oh, we Irish lads are all infirm and our moods infect us like a germ Cause we're all the spawn of a pickled sperm And we don't tan well either From a drunken Irish dad We set sail from the street called the car. We were sailing away with the cargo of bricks for the Grand City Hall in New York. But the wonderful craft she was rigged for the top. And know how the wild wind blows her. She stood several blasts. She had 27 masts. And they called her the Irish Rover. Well, William Bikes so the best lawyer. We had two million barrels of gold. We had three million barrels of our nanny got sales. We had four million barrels of stone. We had five million dogs, six million hogs, seven million barrels of birds. We had eight million hides of our blind horses' hides. And all of the Irish Rover. Yeah. 
And we're here in Clarny because we've been invited by a very special character. I hear he's a local legend, and his name is Sham. Oh, Sham, look at that. No reason, Sham, look at that. Sham, how are you? Oh, my dear. We're here in Killarney today. Nice to meet you. Are you from Killarney? I'm from I'm, 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 Born and bred. Born and bred in Killarney. And come here, Sham, we're trying to figure out what makes Killarney so special. What do you think makes it a great town? All right, kid. Step in the morning in Killarney. All the tourists bring more of that. Not hard to the door. Yeah. Lots of tourists around. The tourists don't Killarney. It's great, isn't it? Great. Give me a job away. And what's your favorite thing about Killarney? Timmy Carmel, my best thing, Chattery Glen. Timmy Carmel from Chattery Glen. He played my best, Timmy Carmel. Yeah. Chattery Glen. Good player. And I tell you what we're going to do today. Tell me if you think this is a good idea or not. We're going to go with the Jarvie. Jarvis? Yeah. Good idea? Quite an hour. I don't <laughs> Everybody's acting weird. What's this? I see no holiday, just lots of drinking. Give me some. This isn't fair. A oh, gross. What's this? What's this? Everyone is dressed in green. What's this? Conversations most obscene. What's this? The streets are lined with chubby frat boys puking at bad jokes. They keep on laughing. What the holy fuck is happening? What is this? What's this? Oh. 
who's yelling and there's brawling Could this be a holy day? The churches are all empty Priests are slurring what they say I guess I'll try another glass with frost on the outside I drink it and I feel a warmth that's building up inside Oh man, what's this? I'm serving it dyed green Yes miss, another one of these Refreshing! It's strengthening my back will wit and courage All this power from ingesting What's this? What's this? This day! I get its point at last To praise the contents of this glass Oh my! They worship it in many different things Out of hats and with hot wings And it makes friends of everyone Who knew there was a patron saint Of having fun and drinking tons Even black guys turn Irish What's this? Well, you're walking through a city street You could be in Peru And you hear a distant calling And you know it's meant for you Then you drop what you are doing And you join the merry mob And before you know just where you are You're in an Irish pub They've got one in Honolulu They've got one in Moscow too They've got four of them in Sydney And a couple in Kathmandu So whether you sing or pull a pint You'll always have a job Cause wherever you go around the world You'll find an Irish now that design is fairly simple And it usually works the same You'll have Razor Houghton scoring in the Ireland-England game And you'll know you're in an Irish pub The minute you're in the door For a couple of boys with morons Will be more than Christy Moore They've got one in Honolulu They've got one in Moscow too They've got four of them in Sydney And a couple in Kathmandu So whether you sing or call a pint You'll always have a job Cause wherever you go around the world You'll find an Irish Pub. Near Pembridge Town, in a county town, one morning, loves your life. Got a boring ring, came a sweet calling for the smile, just the best we buy. She looked so sweet from a dove of feet, from a sheen of a nut brown hair. Such a coaxing girl, sure I shook myself for the sea, I was really there. From Bunchy Bay on the Derrick Cay, and we're going to Dublin Town. Gorthian County Kerry are investigating the theft of up to 60 sheep on Mount Brandon. One of the farmers is offering a reward for information leading to the return of the ewes, which are worth thousands of euro. Well, then find me asking them. That's right, then. You own them in. And you want them to eat. Find me asking them. Last Saturday, Mikey them. Joe O'Shea brought his flock of Scotch sheep down from the mountain commonage ahead of lambing. Yeah. He discovered over 50 were missing. Allowing for a number of deaths and strays, Mikey is convinced over 45 sheep have been stolen. What's about a night? There'd be a full moon there about a night and then sure it'd be bright out and there could anyone go up in the mountains about a night, sure. Well, there was 45 sheep missing, Mike, and the lambs and everything, the sheep. Let's count, let's count out a nice bit of money, Mike. I can be done about it, nothing. Some sort, in the water. Mikey's next door neighbour says some of his sheep have also been stolen. Come back, come Sergeant Biden 
in lightning, corn and light and airy tongue, give it up in the mirror to keep me out from taking notes of my knees, dear, when airy's up for drinking to see the lassie smile, laughing all the while, my curious thoughts would set your heart to roll, asked if I was hired, the wages I required to lie was almost tired of the rocky road to Dublin, one, two, three, four, five, hunt the air and turn her down the rocky road, and all the way to Dublin, whack the lullaby. Wishing song. Oh, I wish I had time to sing you a song. But when I get started, I sing all night long. Ha, 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 ha. Can you put a right to that? Try me. Go on then. Oh, singing's no sin, and drinking's no crime. If you have one drink only, just one at a time. <laughs> I wish all the rhymers were like Brian Connors. When it comes to rhyming, he takes all the honors. <laughs> <laughs> uh, can you read that? Hold your fist. Oh, I knew you could sing when you opened your mug. So you carry the tune, and I'll carry the jug. <laughs> <laughs> um, will we have another round? There's nothing stopping us. Good. Now hear the story, a little bit gold, a little bit happy, and a little bit sad, about Lily the Pink and her medicinal compound, and how it drove us raving mad. Ebenezer, he's standing with Julius Caesar, so they put him in the hole, uh -oh. and then they gave him medicinal compounds, and now he's emperor of Rome. We
Well, I took a stroll down the old long walk on the day I yeah, yeah. met a little girl and we stopped to talk on a fine soft day. I and I ask you, friend, what's a fellow to do? Cause her hair was black and her eyes were blue. And if you're right, then I'll be taking a whirl round the Salt Hill Brom with the Galway girl. When the rain came down on a day, ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. She asked me up to a flat downtown on a fine soft day, ah, yeah. I asked you, friend, what's a fella to do? Cause her hair was black and her eyes were blue. I'm Jason Calabri with the Financial News and today we're talking to a real Irishman and someone in the money business about what's going on in Ireland with the Celtic Tiger and the, and the, the, the banks are hurting so much, the downfall. What's, what's the story here? Do you, do you really want to know? I'd love to know. Well, I'll tell you, it's like what has happened all over the Western world for the last 20 or 30 years. Greed, greed, and more fucking greed, and cheap money. And in Ireland, it's a tragedy what happened to the Tiger. We have, uh, I'd say, four causes. We had a stupid fucking government. Uh, we had a regulator that was asleep at the wheel. And uh, we had uh, very deceitful and conniving and corrupt developers. And, of course, above all, wanking fucking bankers wanking bankers we had these assholes that for the last 20 30 years are getting these massive bonuses these employees and directors of banks on the misfortune of the working class and getting these huge bonuses and salaries but you know if you and all these assholes should be thrown in jail and the keys thrown away for the rest of their life My name is Captain Kidd As I sailed, as I sailed Oh, my name is Captain Kidd As I sailed My name is Captain Kidd And God's laws I did forbid And most wickedly I did as I sailed My father taught me well To shun the gates of hell But against him I rebelled As I sailed He shook the Bible in my hand But I left it in the sand And I pulled away from land as I sailed My name is Captain Kidd As I sailed, as I sailed Oh, my name is Captain Kidd As I sailed My name is Captain Kidd And God's laws I did forbid And most wickedly I did as I sailed I murdered William Moore And I left him in his door When he leads away from shore As I sailed Sean O'Farrell, tell me why you hurry so Hush me bugle, hush and listen And his cheeks were all aglow I bear orders from the captain Make you ready quick and soon For the pikes must be together By the rising of the moon By the rising of the moon By the rising of the moon For the pikes must be together By the rising of the moon Oh, then tell me, Sean O'Farrell Where the gathering is to be In the old spot by the river Right well known to you and me One word more for signal token Whistle up the marching tune With your pipe upon your shoulder By the rising of the moon By the rising of the moon By the rising of the moon With your pipe upon your shoulder By the rising of the moon Oh, my God. 
I met this wee lassie And says I, me wee pet But the answer she gave me I would never forget Her screech and moan Was heard on the moon And he invented a wonderful drink and he made it out of hops. He must have been an actor who was an horror king. And to his favors we shall always sing. Look what he has done for us, the fool of love is sheer. Look at that shoddy book, the man who went to me. The fury spiral cleanses from the whole the world as well. But once and you can be sure that Charlie's really sell. So come on, me lucky lads, eleven o'clock is stuff. For five short seconds, remember Charlie Mox. He must have been an emperor, a sweet and horrid king. And to the spirit, we shall always sing. Look what he has done for us, the fool of every cheer. Lord bless Charlie Mox, the man who went to me. Was a ship that put to sea, and the name of the ship was the Billy of Tea. The winds blew up and her body dipped down, oh blow, me bully boys blow. Soon may the wellermen come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. Someday when the tongue is done, we'll take our leave and go. She had not been two weeks from shore, when down on her a right whale bore. The captain called all hands and swore he'd take that whale in tow. Sugar and tea and rum Someday when the tonguing is done We'll take our leave and go Before the boat had hit the water The whale's tail came up and caught her All hands on the side harpooned and fought her When she dived down below Soon may the weathermen come To bring us sugar and tea and rum Someday when the tonguing is done We'll take our leave and go And 
the world today sure can drain your soul. Your husband and your children suck, and your aliens an asshole. Alien? You've an alien? Sometimes you should escape to a crappy airport bar. Where husbands don't know where you are. Eep, beep, beep, eep, beep, 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 beep. Did you know these napkins are exact replicas of the ones they use in the original Arrivals in Ireland? Why would I know that? Wait, Arrivals is a chain? I thought it was just a bad pun. Oh, no. The flagship is in Dublin, and it's a good pun. Look, my photo's on the wall. I got it from completing the Drinks of Dublin tour. I'll be your dream, I'll be your wish, I'll be your fantasy. I'll be your hope, I'll be your love, be everything that you need. I love you more with every breath, truly, madly, deeply do. I will be strong, I will be faithful, cause I'm counting on a new beginning. can't be William Wallace. I'm prettier than this man. All right, father. I'll ask him. If I risk my neck for you, will I get a chance to kill Englishmen? Is your father a ghost? Or do you converse with the Almighty? In order to find his equal, an Irishman is forced to talk to God. Yes, father. The Almighty says, don't change the subject, just answer the fucking question. Mind your tongue. And seen Irish. Smart enough to get a dagger past your guards, old man. That's my friend, Irishman. And the answer to your question is yes. You fight for me, you get to kill the English. 
Excellent. Stephen is my name. I'm the most wanted man on my island. Except I'm not on my island, of course. More's the pity. Your island? You mean Ireland? Yeah, it's mine. One pleasant evening in the month of June As I was sitting with my glass and spoon A small bird sat on an ivy bunch And the song he sang was the juggle punch Dora Lora Lo, Dora Lora Lay Dora Lora Lo, Dora Lora Lay a small bird sat on an ivy bunch And the song he sang was the juggle punch What more diversion can a man desire Than to sit and down by a snug turf fire Upon his knee a pretty wench I and on the table a juggle punch do la la -lo -la -lo -lo. Tu ai, wow, tu ai, John 
St. Patty, but I remember snakes were involved, and the green paint's for the uh, beer. Okay, love the snake. Great catch there. Yeah. But why not just use food coloring for the beer? Uh, because beer's not a food. When was the last time you ate a beer? When was the last time you drank paint? Have you been drinking paint? No. Let me see your tongue. Oh my god, dude! Oh, that shit's just disgusting! It's not bad. You can't drink paint. I know, I know, I hear you, I hear you, I hear you. You say that, but I don't think that you're gonna stop. I, I get it, though, man. That's a, right. I, I feel like you're saying you get it, but you don't get it. It's cool. It's not cool. It is what it is. My god, this is so frustrating! Look, I'm gonna go down to the basement, I, I'm gonna check out my glue traps and see if I, you know, got a leprechaun in Wait, there. No, 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 no. no. We said no leprechaun this year. You're not chasing leprechaun. I know, I, I kind of forgot we're landing on that. I got these great cookie sheets, they're full of glue. It's just, but I hear you, I hear you. It's a frustrating thing. It's like the guy doesn't listen to us, man. We're trying to get through. Let me see.
I was roving out one evening as I came down to Fort Law. I walked into a dimly pop and suddenly I saw the shakes they were so rosy and cold was her hair. She had to be an Irish girl cause she looked so goddamn fair. She took me by her lovely hand and whispered in my ear, I'll guide you up to heaven if you'll order me a beer. Seconds later I found myself beside this pretty lass. Want a thought in my head and an ale in my glass. Hey! superstitious man, he leaves a tiny keepsake from his good luck bracelet on every victim he kills. Scotland Yard would love to get their hands on that piece of evidence. Yeah, they're always after me lucky charms. <laughs> what? Why does everyone always laugh when I say that? They are after me lucky charms! <laughs> what? It's a television commercial with this cartoon leprechaun and all of these children are trying to chase him. Hey, leprechaun man, leprechaun man, we want to get your lucky charms. <laughs> oh, and there's always these little tiny bits of marshmallows just stuck right in the cereal so that when the kids eat them, they think, oh, this is candy, I'm having fun. <laughs> And pitch to the devil, crump, call the can spleen You'll know it, I think, if you take a big drink With your mouth to the brink of a jug per chin. So stick to the crater, the best thing in nature For sinking your sorrows and raising your joys Oh, what botheration, no dose in the nation Can give consolation like put you 
a child in my cradle My nurse with her ladle was filling my mouth with a notion of pop When a drop from her bottle fell into my throttle I stumbled and capered clean out of her lap On the floor I lay crawling and screaming and bawling To my mother and father were called out to the floor All sobbing and crying they thought I was dying But soon found I only was crying for more So stick to the crater, the best thing in nature for sinking your sorrows and raising your joys Oh lord how they chuckle if babes their chuckle They only could suckle on Puccini boys Well, just in time for St. Patrick's Day, crowds are coming by the dozens to get an up-close view at what some say is a piece of Irish folk folklore. Some people in the Crichton area of Mobile say a leprechaun has taken up residence in their neighborhood. A leprechaun. NBC 15's <laughs> Brian Johnson has more. Curiosity leads to large crowds in Mobile's Crichton community. Many of you bring binoculars, camcorders, even camera phones to take pictures. To me, it looked like a leprechaun to me. All I got to do is look up in the tree. Who else in the leprechaun say yeah? yeah! Eyewitnesses say the leprechaun only comes out at night. If you shine a light in its direction, it suddenly disappears. This amateur sketch resembles what many of you say the leprechaun looks like. Others find it hard to believe and have come up with their own theories and explanations for the image. My theory is it's casting a shadow from the other limb. Could be a crackhead that got hold to the wrong stuff. And it told him to get up in a tree and play a leprechaun. Way haul away, well haul away, Joe. No way haul away, the good ship now is rolling to me. Way haul away, well haul away, Joe. No first time at the Yankee girl, and she was fat and lazy to me. Way haul away, well haul away. An Irish girl, she damn near drove me crazy, Tammy. Way haul away, well haul away, Joe. St. Patrick was a gentleman, he came from Jason people, Tammy. Way haul away, well haul away, Joe. He built a church in Dublin town and on it put a steeple to me. Way haul away, well haul away, Joe. just a legend, except for those who knew better. When it took the Mason's daughter, it was tragic. When it took a barrel of John Jameson's whiskey, well, that was another matter. But Jameson was generous. Would prove foolish for the heart of that. 
Chakra. And of all the harm that e'er I've done Alas, it was to none but me And for all I've done For want of wit 
to memory now I can't recall so fill to me the parting glass good night and joy be with you all and to all the comrades that e'er I had who would be sorry for my going away and to all the sweethearts that e'er I've loved who would bid me one more day to stay and as it falls upon my lot that I should rise and you should not so fill to me the parting glass good night and joy be with you all and if I had money enough to spare and leisure time to sit a while there is a girl in this fair land who surely has my heart beguiled with her long dark hair and ruby lips she surely has my heart enthralled so raise to me the parting glass good night and joy be with you all so raise to me the parting glass good night and joy be with you all Thanks. Thanks a lot.